Hi, Simon Ward here, thetriathloncoach.com. So, stretching, it's one of those things we all know that we should do, and most of us don't. Why? Because it takes up too much time, you haven't got time, you can't be bothered, you forget. The easiest way is to, to link your training with your stretching, or your stretching with your training. So, here's a little routine that you can do in the showers, straight after every swim session. It's primarily an upper body stretching routine. So here goes. Find a bit of wall or a pillar or the, the uh, pipe for the shower if it's not too hot. Just put your forearm against it and just turn in. So you're stretching the pectoral muscle on the front of the shoulder. And don't put too much pressure on it, just feel the stretch, hold it for 20 seconds. Okay, then in that position, just put the outside foot in front of the inside leg and reach over the top, stretching quadratus lumborum. Get a slightly different stretch by putting that foot behind the inside leg as well. Okay, still facing the same way, take a lunge forward with the outside leg. The inside leg comes across and then you put your hand on the wall or you rest your forearm on until you can feel the stretch on the inside hip. This is TFL. It's a great way to guard against IT band syndrome. So we're about a minute in now. Shower's still going. You're getting washed. Put some shampoo on your hair. Obviously, you're going to do those stretches on the other side as well. But in between, we're going to do some upper back and shoulder stretches. So the first one is bring one arm across your chest. Hold on by the forearm. Squeeze your shoulder blades together to get a stretch around here. Okay, don't forget to do the other side. Then, put both hands together in a praying position. Squeeze your elbows together and lift as high as you can until your elbows start to come apart. Hold that, that's a good lat stretch. Then, this is like a yoga stretch. Put one arm up, cross over. Now I'm getting a stretch on the left side of my shoulder. And you unwind, and I'll get a stretch around here. Okay, so, do all of those stretches after every swim session. It'll help you to loosen up your shoulders. It means you don't have to worry about doing your stretching at another time of day. And tomorrow, I'm going to bring you some stretches that you can do before and after every bike or every run. Okay, thanks for watching. See you next time.